And so when you seen all this happen with the RICO charge and gun and all them going to jail, you knew you had to be there for it. Man, let me tell you something. We know R. Kelly. Yes. Why would they give him a RICO charge? Hmm. R. Kelly? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. But I'm praying for one young brother when he get out, young thug. I've been working with uh, him. Yeah, yeah, you been working he's with him? Ready, he's mm -hmm. getting ready to get out. I've been going to jail to see him. I've been flying back and forth. Back and forth. As a minister of him standing with him when he go into court, I've been there for young thug, but I know he finna get out because the judge said on the 16th, if y'all don't bring that evidence, he gonna be he out gonna, How long, okay, how did you end up building, even having a relationship to even help him? With young thug? thug. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I have a beauty shop, and my daughter, Sade, and, and uh, Shay, you know, I got Reverend Toby, he got a barber shop, and Vic run the, uh, the, I have a luxury rental, Rolls Royce's company. So my kids, when people come to Chicago, we have a rental, luxury rental uh, USA. Mm -hmm. We pick up all of the celebrities their age. So my daughter, she go pick them up, and my daughter, Sade, she make wigs for the girls and okay. sisters, little okay. body them. So my daughters, they know a lot of people, you know, in the young generation. So when he came to the beauty shop, he knew me, I didn't know him. He knew you. He knew who I was. And so when you seen all this happen with the RICO charge and gun and all them going to jail, you knew you had to be there for it. Man, let me tell you something. We know R. Kelly. Yes. Why would they give him a RICO charge? Hmm. R. Kelly, I tell you again, he came around us coming to the playoffs, ball. Yeah. They all want to be Bishop Don Magic Warren. Not me. They want to be him. R. Kelly, we used to go visit him. Know what he do? He'll clap his hand. His girls are going to back. But R. Kelly is not no pimp. He's not no player. He, he maybe have some mental problems or whatever. I don't know, but what I'm saying, he wanted to be like Bishop. And why would they give him the RICO charges? Why would they get the other RICO charges? It's a new law. They want to bury young brothers now. Wow. You these young brothers, man, I don't want the parties. They had bring trucks come and throw money all off the roof. Bring trucks of money, 20s and 50s and 100s. Man, you know where we came from? We couldn't afford to throw a dollar away. Hmm. I couldn't throw a nickel away. That's real. Mm -hmm. That's and so man, the shit these young brothers down, they came up with a RICO law. Right. Wow. Do you think R. Kelly will ever come out? Yeah, I believe so, because mm -hmm. you know why? They know, they just, the slow, sometimes we get hard-headed sometimes. You know, and some of the women's, they get hard-headed too in their marriages and stuff like that. Then you know, and people don't understand that uh, some of the best, the beautiful women, they like to sleep on the couch, don't like to sleep in the bed with their husband. They want to sleep in the, uh, in the bed with their blue jeans on. So they get hard headed. Oh, you know, it, it, it goes up and down. Mm. And you got to be ready for the game because the game is cold, but it's fair. So we know I Kelly ain't do that, but I back again, like I said, on our boy Snoop Dogg, I love the dog. The dog is a gentleman, mm -hmm. and he can go on anybody's show and do it right. That's true. Any commercial you see Snoop Dogg do, he did it right. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.